Welcome to my downward spiral, downward spiral, downward spiral. Today we're going to be editing photos. See, looky here. Now Bob Ross, he's painting a lovely picture. You know what would make this painting even lovelier? If it had a nice little elongated muskrat to spice things up a little bit. See, look at this. Now that looks very lovely. See, look. Now he do, he's a master painter, he was, R.I.P. But, look at this. He didn't just paint one, he painted a whole host of ones. He painted many. He also did many other wonderful things, such as this. Now you might think that this is a little bit interesting, and you'd be right to think that. Because when you look down from heaven, and you see a Zuckerberg looking down on you, and when he looks down from heaven upon you, first of all, he has many things to say about you. None of them are good, but that's beside the point, because Zuckerberg's judgment is the definitive judgment. So I'm not sure where I'm going with this. And one more thing. This is masterpiece number one. It's, uh, it's, it's great. All right, photo number two. We have a lizard thing. Now, how can we screw this up? Um, let's see. So, we're gonna make this lizard look real funky. So actually, first of all, we're gonna grab lots and lots of eyes. Let's just get some eyes from this little lizard. And so now that we've got our nifty little eye, we get to invert the color. And we get to put it all over. Alright. We got a nice little thing here. We're gonna we're gonna use Keanu a bit. We're just gonna put his head over here. And great, look at that. And here, my friends is Keanu Reeves, the Lizard Man, and if you thought that he was done, oh boy, you ain't seen nothing yet. This lovely man right here is called Martin Luther, and here we are. Now, for those of you who've never made a tail before, what you simply want to do is rotate and stick it on right there. And voila, you've got yourself a tail, man. It also kind of looks like a horrible creature that has two heads. Um, but we're just not going to think about that. Now, Keanu, he's looking very, very attentively down at this bowl. And he's expecting to be fed. So now you see, we take this man right here. We paste his image over a place where it wasn't supposed to be pasted. And there, we have our beautiful masterpiece, number two. So as you see, we have a bee here. Now, what I'm going to start doing is mixing these photos. So you see this lovely bee, this lovely bee just caught on the side of this, this, um, this thing, this door. Excuse me, I can't speak sometimes. And you see this lovely memeable photo. So we're going to mix these. That's very small, let's make that larger. That's large enough, and that also gives us room to do this. Now this is the interesting part. This is the cropping part. Now I don't have a very good editing software. This is the default editing software for Windows, so it is not very good. Alright, great. We have our B. Now, all we need to do is just crop that out, and we, then we, uh, we close that, and we bring out the bee, and then we just put it on top of his head, and now he's looking like he's ready to die inside. So we just trace the top of his head.
this is the epic part. This is where we actually give the photo some layers. And we just place that right back where it was. Now it just looks like he's burrowing into it. You know what? These things happen and they happen for the best. Because this, this is actually better than I could have hoped for. We're just going to make this a bit more edgy. And now it looks like he's about to kill something. Alright, great. He's holding the gun. Um, you know, his eyes look a little bit boring. Um, then again, that is the whole meme part, but uh, you know what? His mouth, actually. His mouth looks kind of boring, too. So we're going to do away with it. He's going to have a blank mouth. And just like that. Read that, and look at that. And uh, now it looks even more plain. So we're gonna add something else. A tooth. No. Actually, yes. Um, now the, those tooth, the, those teeth look a little bit boring. We're gonna add a little bit of detail to them. Great. We're gonna make his eyes more swollen. Uh, like this. This is how you, one would uh, accomplish this atrocity. Like this. Now it looks like his pupils are super huge, which is kind of, which is what I wanted to go for. Now I'm not sure what the what the meaning of this photo is. Um, you can you can tell me your interpretations in the comments. I honestly don't know. Whatever it is, it's it's not very good. Um, all right, that actually looks really scary now. Oh no, what have I what have I done? Masterpiece number three. All right, so here we have a child. Now this baby looks like it could eat a planet, so we're gonna do just that. All right, so we trace this. And now we have our baby. And what we're going to do with our baby is trace the baby's head. So now that we have our child, he looks like he's ready to devour. We're going to put him just like right there. And uh, yep, he's, he's ready for a meal. Alright, and there you have it. This child is ready to devour the whole of the planet. You know what? We should put some... We should put some more detail. And there you have it. Masterpiece number four. Alright, now we come to the fun part. Here is Shrek. Now, we're gonna place Shrek in his natural environment, because he looks a little bit... Uh, uncomfortable in his present situation. So this is where we do the screen screen. And here we have the finished product. You may use this photo if you want for whatever edits you can make. But we're going to use this as just a green screen. Now I don't know about you, but I find Shrek's original swamp to be kind of boring at this point. So we're going to spice it up. So we already have this, and we're going to add just go ahead and add this to it um, as like a guardian over the, uh, the swamp. And now we have a little guardian just peeking over the swamp, making sure that everything's going fine. Because you see, there's a threatening presence in the swamp. There's this. Now that's not the real Shrek. Alright, so there's also this thing, it happens to be a swamp monster, and it looks horrid, but we're not done yet, we still need more swampery. This thing goes right here, I don't know, I guess it's the face of the tree. There we go, more Shrek, add a little Shrek over here, by the door, he's just guarding the house, he's, he's friendly, 
Now, there's one more Shrek addition besides the main one that we need to add. And here we have it. Okay. Now, with all this Shrek, where do we add our main Shrek? And there you have it. And that's the finished product, and it's... If you, if you couldn't say it was a Shrek song before, you certainly can now. Now, that's the last masterpiece that I'm making for today. I have one more unused picture, but I have no idea what to do with this. I'm sure it has some use. Um, if you have an idea, let me know. I, I currently have no idea what to do with it. But anyway, thank you for watching this video. Send me pictures. I will do epic edits for you. Do it on Discord. Do it in my server. Anyway, goodbye. Thank <laughs> you.